What's up everyone? George from Filmora here to empower your inner video creator. So when I first saw awesome drone footage, I was inspired to get some aerial shots of my own. <laughs> but I quickly realized I had to actually learn to fly the drone first. And doing so was way more challenging than I thought. So I figured I'd make this video to teach you how to actually fly a drone properly so you can get to the filming part way more quickly. So depending on what drone you have, it'll fly differently. More expensive drones, they essentially fly themselves but when their GPS fails, you have to fly them manually. Cheaper drones, you have to fly them manually anyways. So you have to learn how to fly those bad boys. For this video, we're gonna be using the DJI Mavic Pro. But it doesn't really matter what drone you use. We're gonna give you some really good tips so you can learn the controls and get you flying as quickly as possible. Before you go out flying, I suggest you take some measures to ensure you don't crash. Get familiar with your drone's control before you fly it for the first time. Some companies have a flight simulator you can practice with first, like the DJI GO app, and we use this before we even went flying our DJI Mavic. When you're ready to fly, do so in an open area. There's some cool apps out there and a simple Google search will help you find a drone zone near you. Try to use an open field and avoid things like electrical poles, trees, and Wi-Fi hotspots. No matter where you fly, always keep your drone in eyesight. You should be able to see it no matter where you are. If you fly too far away and there are a lot of objects, your only field of view will be the drone's camera. This is super limiting because you can only see what the camera sees. And the camera doesn't have a large field of view so you can bump into something super easily. Make sure there's little to no wind maximum 15 miles per hour or 24 kilometers per hour if you're in Canada, like us, eh? The last thing you're gonna need to prepare to avoid crashing is making sure to have enough battery power when you go out. I usually land my drone when my battery is about 25% so I can make sure it'll come back to me. Here are a few flight exercises that'll help you. How to master flight. To help show you some drone stuff, I got Trevor here. Hey. You ready, George? <laughs> yeah, well. Take off. The only control you need to get your drone off the ground is the left throttle. However, your drone might have an auto takeoff and landing feature. So if you're unsure and want to leave it to the drone, use it. Simple movements. When flying for the first time, stick to small movements to get used to the control and drone sensitivity. So the controls on the DJI Mavic Pro have you moving left and right, forward and back with the right stick, and going up and down in altitude with the left stick, rotating your drone's camera. Also, if your drone has a beginner's mode, use it when starting out. It'll help keep your drone at a lower speed and altitude to help you avoid erratic movements and flying too far away. Advanced flying technique, the circle. After learning some basic movements and landing, try some more advanced flying techniques. Try flying in a circular motion around your subject. You'll need to use both sticks on the remote to fly in a circle. Practice flying clockwise and counterclockwise because the techniques are a little bit different. Thanks for watching everyone. I hope these tips help you learn to fly a drone. Once you got some awesome drone footage, you can try Filmora. It's a powerful and simple editing solution for your videos. Please hit that sweet subscribe button if you haven't already. We're uploading filmmaking tutorials every week. I'm George from Filmora, here to empower your inner video creator, and I'll see you next time. Ciao.